Javier. I heard about a house. Could be interesting. What kind of a house? I don't know. A couple fellas I heard in town, they said... said it was really... freakish. A family local boogeyman, I guess. But they're crooked in every way. So? Well, so these boys thought they were sitting on a lot of cash. And they're highway robbers, kidnappers, apparently. They're well hidden in the woods. That sounds pretty dubious. Of course. Uh, yeah, it's dubious, but there ain't much risk of getting caught. Okay, then. Let's go take a look. Exactly. Just take a look. It's up north, on the other side of the river from Valentine. This way there is through Cumberland Falls, though. You know it? Sure, more or less. now. Let's stop and go on foot from here. Just up the hill this way. Follow me. There's a spot up ahead where we should be able to get a good look at the place. I want to make sure we don't run into any surprises. Sure. Apparently, this family's been isolated for so long, they started talking in their own weird dialect. They really don't like outsiders, especially on their turf. <sighs> well, you just keep selling me on this job, don't you? Now, big place, right? Big barn in the back. It's not a bad place to start looking. There must be a lot of people living here. A large house. Stash could be in any one of them buildings, and who knows how many people are in there. <clears throat> I ain't sure about this. Boy, I, I think we need to draw them out somehow. And I got an idea. Follow me. It'll make it harder for them to spot us, too. Coast seems clear so far. Yeah, so far. Hey, keep it down. I hear voices. Hide behind this shed. See if we can hear what they're saying. Just stay quiet. I'm one smell. Creepers, man. Don't for notions of the Dippy Plymouth head. Where you been now, Newt? Don't be boiling now, Pappy. I was gone for ten minutes, I was. You can holly gag all day day long, cause Edie takes patrol now, don't you? What? No, Edie, get all the jam! You shut your gulper, or I'll flag her your felt, I will. You need to pull it up, boy. Up. Go guard the shed. Go! 
Under here, there's no place else that could store it. Hey, Arthur, give me a hand here. I told you it was worth the trouble, didn't I? Yeah, you take this. Let's split up. I'll meet you back at camp. Right, sounds good. Okay. 